what's up guys, today I'm going to teach you how to make something magically appear just with the click of your fingers. When I recorded the footage I made sure I turned the autofocus off the camera just so it wouldn't bounce around trying to search the foreground or the background subject and then I made sure the shoe was in the focal point before I started recording and then just put it to the side at arm's reach. After you click your fingers making sure you're leaving your hand exactly where it is just so you get that seamless effect, reach to the side where your shoe is and then place it back in your hand. Then click your fingers again, and that's where your transition point's gonna be. Okay, now we've got our footage, let's go across to Final Cut Pro. Select the section you're after and place it into your timeline. Now scroll across to where you click your fingers and let's bring up the blade tool either by just hitting R on the keyboard or clicking on the drop down and selecting blade. And just as you click your fingers, that's where you make your cut. Now let's scroll across to where we've put the shoe in our hand and we're gonna make the second click. And just there is where we're gonna use our blade tool again. Then what we want to do is hit A on the keyboard or click on the drop down for our select tool. Once we've got that, let's select the section of the video that we don't need and then just delete that. Now you've got your two clips joined together, you can see how the shoe magically appears. But let's make that a little bit cooler by adding some smoke to the effect. Bring your smoke down to your timeline and put it above your clip. Then go across to blend mode, click on the drop down, select subtract. Then we want to speed the smoke up, so we go across to our timing icon click on the drop down, go across to fast, and I'll put it to four times. Now let's move the smoke to where we need to. Click on transform, move the smoke to where you need to adjust it to, and then click on done. Now let's add some sound effects and some background music, and let's check out what we've got. Thanks so much for watching, I hope you found this useful. Feel free to hit the like button or the subscribe if this is something you're interested in, or even just drop a comment just to let me know what part of the video you liked. Thanks again for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next one.